about this? Mm. Locals uh, were surprised to see a pig in a pub. Oh. Well, I'm not surprised. Um, <laughs> I've seen a few pigs in I've pubs. I've seen a few pigs, met heaps of them. Um, uh, you, you went there. Um, uh, oh, I didn't think you were going to do that. <laughs> Locals <laughs> were surprised to see a pig in a working men's club in County Durham. Uh, oh. The pig, believed to be called Roddy. Uh, it's a cute pig. Ran Is around that... hoping to get a pat from the punters. Customers at the club managed to lure him outside the venue with cheese and onion chips. Oh, my goodness. This is <laughs> what happens around here. Yeah, exactly. How do we get you outside the studio? Um, <laughs> salt and vinegar for you, I think, until mm. someone ar- arrived to claim him. But he's one of those kind of spotty ones. Yeah, yeah. the cute poke pig. No, I don't really like those. You know who I'm has like those pigs? Who? who? Marco Pierre White. Of course, he bloody does. Yeah, and what does he do then? He walks around mm, and goes, slice them up and put them on a plate at Easter. <laughs> at Easter? <laughs> at Easter. Um, no, that, that, that Anthony Bourdain he did years ago when he's walking around, he's probably going, piggy, 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 oh. piggy, 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 and they'd all just run to him and he'd feed them like he loved them. I love, I like pigs. I do too. You're like, yeah, in terms of animals, they're up there. And, for I, you know, weirdly no. for me, I'm not a huge pork guy. Like, I'll eat it, but I'm not. You know how some people are mad for pork? I'm I love mad for a bit of pork. pork. I love yeah. pork. But out of all the meats, that's. Oh, that's, lamb. Right. Lamb lollipops for me. Yeah, lamb, but pork, I love you call them lollipops. But the thing is, for me, I don't like. Well, I love to eat pork. But I'm not a big pig fan because I went to the agricultural school. No, Did you? of course. <laughs> <laughs> and uh, because it was across the road on uh, Roy Roy Watts Road, I think it was, or something, yeah. the stink, like yeah. when the wind came, the stink of the pig um, pens or whatever they were called, I just can't, they're just so stinky. Now, I'm not sure if Joel was around for this wonderful conversation years ago, but mm-hmm. you know, if you, you don't kind of castrate a pig properly and then you cook it, the smell is called... Boar taint, and the, when I Why is it when I made now? pork at home a few years ago, oh, and yeah. I had this stank in my house for really? weeks. Then I found out it's boar taint. <gasps> That's revolting. So I'll have bacon, I'll have ham, I'll have a, a, a porchetta roast. What about if a I'm, pork cutlet? If Ooh. I'm out, mm. yeah, cooking pork at home, I think I don't do it anymore. Okay, all right. Oh, porchetta because of the boar. Amazing. Yeah, well, remember when I had to cut the nipple the out nipple. of the porchetta? Yes. It was all hair. Wasn't there hair on the nipple? Yes, but the fact is that there was a nipple. Like there's organic and there's organic. I know, I know. Remove the nipple. Yes, and then do you, then the question is, do you cut the nipple out or do you cook the nipple and well, then not eat it? What did um, you do? I cut it out raw, which I regret <gasps> because it made it look like I was covering up a murder. I know. <laughs> Fry it up, don't you? What well, I did. Now I will. I will now. Like in hindsight, oh. I would have fried it up. And then not, and then cut it out. But cutting it out in the flesh, you, I don't ever want to have to experience that again. Oh my gosh! You pickled it or something? Skin, yeah. The skin of a, the skin of pork is thicker. Ooh. It's real thick too, mm. isn't it? I do yeah. a great. I do a great. Um, uh, fried nipple. Yeah, fried nipple. I love it. Oh yeah, uh, breakfast, lunch, and dinner. Oh, you know what? Mm. Pork dot com. Did I use Sam Choi Bao? Or Song Choi Bao? Whatever. Oh, yeah. I don't know how to say it. I'm so confused. Kate, Tim, and Joel.